Welcome to the video tutorial of GreenCloud VPS. Today, we will show you how to install and configure VNC server on Ubuntu 22.04. First, install the VNC server by running the following commands in your terminal. Next, ensure you have a desktop environment installed on your Ubuntu. For this guide, we'll install the XFCE desktop environment. You can choose to use other desktop environments. Once you've finished the installation of the desktop environment and VNC server, configure the VNC server as follows. First, run the following command to set a password for your VNC server. When prompted, enter and verify your password to set. Next, start the VNC server using the following command. You can also kill the VNC server using the following command. Next, the VNC configuration file is located in the following file. Edit it with your favorite text editor. Add the following line at the end of the file. Then, start the VNC server with the following command. Now, you can connect to a remote desktop using a VNC client and SSH tunneling. First, you need to install the UFW firewall and enable port 5901 before connecting. Then install VNC viewer client. Once your SSH tunnel is running, Connect to the local host with port 5901 using the VNC client. When prompted for the password, enter the password created during the VNC server configuration. Once connected, you'll see the default XFCE desktop environment. Setting up the VNC server to run as a system D service allows you to start, stop, and restart it as needed, like any other service. You can also use systemd's management commands to ensure that VNC starts when your server boots up. First, create a new unit file as the following. Next, add the following lines. Don't forget to use your actual remote user and username. Then, save the file and exit when done. Now, reload systemd and start VNC. Stop the current instance of the VNC server if it's still running. Then start it as you would start any other systemd service. And check the status. You now have a secured VNC server up and running on your Ubuntu 22.04 server. Now you'll be able to manage your files, software, and settings with a user-friendly graphical interface, and you'll be able to run graphical software like web browsers remotely.